There are many ways to remove leaves from your lawn, but the quickest, quietest, and cleanest is to use a cordless leaf blower. Just slide in the battery and pull the trigger. There are many ways to remove leaves from your lawn, but the quickest, quietest, and cleanest is to use a cordless leaf blower. Just slide in the battery and pull the trigger. These battery-powered models make little noise and certainly don't spew out exhaust fumes. And many cordless leaf blowers are small and light, which makes them especially well-suited for leaf removal in small yards where one battery charge will probably be enough to see you through the job. Use it in the spring to whisk buds and winter debris off of sidewalks and patios, in the summer to clear grass clippings, and in the fall to move leaves into a pile. There are numerous options for cheap leaf blowers each with unique features, advantages, and costs. I conducted a ton of research, read a ton of reviews, and put up a list of the top affordable leaf blowers from trustworthy manufacturers to help you make an informed choice. Following extensive investigation, I discovered that these products are quite beneficial for persons like you. If you want to know about the price and other information, be sure to check my description. So without any further delay let's jump into the video. Number 1 Ego Power Plus LB6504 Cordless Leaf Blower More and more, we're seeing battery-powered equipment that rivals or exceeds the performance of their gas-powered counterparts. This cordless leaf blower is a case in point. We measured airspeed at 134 miles per hour and found, combined with the volume of air, 650 CFM, claimed that it easily blasted leaves from our test area when we were standing still. Stepping forward while sweeping back and forth cleared the area in seconds. Our sawdust test revealed a focused airstream with sharp edges extending beyond the end of our test area. While the runtime may seem short, bear in mind that's on the turbo setting. In use, we've learned that it's rare to continuously hold down the turbo button or even the trigger. A more realistic runtime, without turbo locked on, is at least 27 minutes. And we could have probably extended the runtime further because the LB6504 features a dial that allowed us to set and hold the airspeed at the lowest setting and use the trigger or turbo button to boost speed when needed. This vastly extends runtime and more realistically reflects typical yard work needs. Number 2. Greenworks 24252 Cordless Axial Leaf Blower. This budget friendly model is the 20 volt version of the above BL80L 2510 meaning it's lighter and expectedly weaker. However, it's the most affordable cordless blower we recommend, and comes with an included battery and charger. It claims a 120 mph airspeed and 500 CFM. Although we haven't tested this one, we generally recommend Greenworks products for value-forward power tools, and given the performance of its stronger brother, which we tested and recommend in this guide, we see promise in this model. Given its weaker power, its battery lasts only 10 minutes at full power, but buying a second one gives it double life. And if you've already subscribed to the Greenworks family, the tool alone is only $100. Several user reviews say it's great for small jobs and spaces, and it's powerful enough to tidy a patio or driveway in a jiffy. One major qualm, however, is its noise, the weaker, it's surprisingly loud, according to many users. Number 3. Greenworks BL80L 2510 Cordless Leaf Blower One of the lightest cordless leaf blowers, even this Greenworks model can replace a gas-powered unit. With our anemometer, we clocked the airspeed at a respectable 127 miles per hour, which falls in the middle of the range for handheld gas blowers. The tube tip is tapered at the end, creating a little narrower, focused airstream, evident in the pattern left in our sawdust test. We also noted more precision when blowing leaves out of our test area, which we cleared in seconds, taking just a few steps. Compared to other models, runtime is fair, considering the 2.5A battery. Greenworks offers 80V batteries up to 5A, which would significantly lengthen how long you can use the BL80L 2510 in one shot. And if you already have a battery from another of their tools, use it and buy just the leaf blower without batteries to save some cash. Number 4. Widest Range Cat 60V800 CFM Leaf Blower At first glance, Cat's leaf blower appears stout with a wide blower tube and tip. This is usually the case with blowers that move a significant volume of air, and the claimed 800 CFM is just that. We clocked airspeed at 115 miles per hour, and with that much air, moving that fast, the Cat cleared a wider swath than most in our sawdust erosion test. Like many models in our testing, 
the controls include a standard trigger, cruise control dial, and turbo boost button. The 60-volt, 800 CFM blower is a bit heavier than some models, partly due to the larger battery format, which is generally the case with higher-speed blowers. While the cat easily cleared debris around the hard surfaces of our testing area, it should also do well on stubborn leaves in or on grass. Number 5. Milwaukee M18 Fuel Cordless Leaf Blower. This cordless leaf blower makes a lot of sense for people that already own tools in Milwaukee's M18 fuel platform, since the batteries are completely interchangeable. It's available as a tool only or with a large, ADA battery, which yielded a continuous runtime of 14 minutes and 45 seconds during our testing. The M18 has two ranges indicated by rabbit and turtle icons, each controlled by the same variable speed trigger. It took us longer to clear the leaves in our test area with the Milwaukee, but it was easier to carry, being roughly 1.5 pounds lighter than any other model we tested. It did take a bit longer to move the leaves, the reason for which we discovered in our sawdust test. While the shape of the Airstream was similar to other handheld blowers, it was a little smaller in both length and width. This isn't really a fault, but a limitation of the lower voltage compared to other models. As such, the M18 might not be ideal for large properties with heavy leaf coverage. It is, however, great for clearing out gutters, sweeping the driveway, blasting debris tracked into the garage or leftover from projects, and clearing sidewalks, porches, patios, and small yards. That's all from my end, I make helpful videos daily so do subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification. To get more information or if you want to know product price please check my description. For any kind of problem please comment below to help you further. Life is short so enjoy every bit of your life with our cool products as it going to make your life much easier. Thanks for watching, have a great day.